Oh, they can actually come from everywhere. If they're all in the vents, that's like so easy. Oh. I can go in here now. Thank you. Hand grenade. Thank you for the ammo. I mean, so far so good though. How did you even... How? Hello guys and welcome to my let's play of Resident Evil Revelations. Uh, I am not a huge Resident Evil fan, but I do like the series. I watch the movies, weirdly enough, but they, they aren't very good movies, but they're, they're fun to watch if you have a, a, a boring day, I guess. Uh, anyway, uh, I, am a, I, I do like what I've seen from Resident Evil 2 Remake and some other stuff. Now, don't let you be turned off by this Let's Play because I'm saying I'm not a big Resident Evil fan. I actually have never played an actual Resident Evil game either. So, maybe that is why I'm not a fan. So, this is gonna be my first actual... Actually, no, I, that's a lie. I played a bit of Resident Evil 5 on the PlayStation 3 a while back. But that's also the only experience I've had with it. Otherwise, I've only seen other people play the game. Not this game. I, I think I saw Resident Evil 7 and then Resident Evil 4. And, uh, the... Oh, what's that one called? Uh, the newer one? The newest one? Resident Evil Village, I think it's called. Uh, but playing myself is something I only did for five. So this is a completely new experience for me. And uh, don't mind the thing. As you can see, I've played for five minutes here. Just to see if everything worked. See if there was anything I needed to adjust in settings. But everything seems A-OK. -okay. So we're going to start a new game. We're going to... Yeah, yeah, I don't care about the data. Just a little test anyway. Uh, we're gonna bring normal difficulty and then we'll see if this game makes me like Resident Evil or if this is just some kind of knockoff. I think I've heard this released on some kind of handheld console or something. But uh, we we'll see, we'll see. Hey, Jill. So that's Jill, right? So is he Chris? Uh, I don't actually know. Incredible. The Queen Zenobia. This thing is lucky to be afloat. Take us around. Let's find a boarding point. Is this some kind of uh, luxury cruise vehicle or what? Or a ship, I mean? I never actually watched the intro. I just kind of skipped this when I uh, tested. <laughs> Chris and Jessica dropped off the radar. But the interpolation from their so last that's not Chris. puts them right here on the ship. Okay, interesting. By the way, if we're being an older game, it looks kind of good still. Doesn't look half bad. So I have a minimap top right. That's what I figured out last time. Can I melee somehow? I guess it'll tell me if I can. Yeah, I'm completely fine. Uh, can I have your name, by the way? <laughs> I forgot your name. I don't know if I said it or something. Ooh, they have a little bell here. I don't like the sound of that. You don't like the sound of a bell? Maybe there's something back. Oh, that's that just leads back to where we were. Okay. Uh, okay. I might be able to shoot it off. All right. I'm not the biggest fan of how light the gun sounds. It doesn't sound loud. It sounds very muffled. And it doesn't look like she has a suppressor on. It's been abandoned for a while. Oh, even a muscle flash, really. Well, hello there, buddy. Are you dead? It smells like rotting flesh. You must be dead. This looks like rotten flesh. Maybe they're like, uh, like alien, where they make a little. What do you want to say? Um, 
nests of stuff. No signs of life, but I feel like something's here. Oh, what what ticks you off? The fact that they're dead bodies and uh hey. ew. What was that? Was that some kind of... What? Is that water? It looks like slime of some kind. Maybe we are dealing with aliens. That can walk. It looks super pale. So it could be some kind of pale man. Who's in the vent. Civilization shaft? Well, alright. Can I take the fire extinguisher and extinguish him? Seems a bit like trouble. There's blood coming from the ducks. Eh. Uh, hello? It's arm. Um, mutation, huh? I hear you over here, buddy. It's not working. So it wants me to follow this, huh? You know, it would be great if you did not do that. You keep going that way. Because there's a way in there. Do you want me to keep going this way? Oh, because that path was blocked. Can I open this up? Nope. Nothing in there. <gasps> we found the plant. I do like my plants. Green herbs, huh? Oh, yeah, I can open them up two times? <laughs> okay. With my short-term memory, it would be great if I didn't have to open them up multiple times, but uh, all right. Little rats, huh? I see that I don't actually have a lot of ammo, so I would prefer to save it if I could. Short it out. Yeah. Well, it's super quiet. Is that because I have lowered my sound settings? Sound effects, voice, uh, sound... No, it's actually maxed out. It's just all the games tend to have this, uh, this audio level. Well, I'm, I'll see if I can't boost the audio uh, in post here. So, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. I have a green herb, huh? If, if you want to fight me, I can heal. And this is another dead body. Ugh. The face is smashed in completely. I don't know. I still kind of see what his eyeballs are supposed to be. Hmm. <laughs> a lot of other stuff here. I mean, that's another way. Is it locked? Take a look at these. Okay. Uh, well, I'll take a look at it after I explore everything. It looks like I can take a look. Parker, give me a hand here. Sure. Is that just a go bunch go. of goop with some kind of light? There's a gun in there. I got something. I think it's a gun. Now what? Give me a sec. We take the gun. Oh, is she gonna get grabbed? <coughs> well, it's not so just a gun. It's not Chris. Uh oh. That's a bit nasty. Don't look at her butt. Ew. That, that looks like venom. Well, well, well. This explains our missing crew. This is not good. Where are you, Chris? Okay. <laughs> All right. Episode one, Into the Depths. Do 
Do I click something or does it just go away by itself? I think I click. So yeah, click. Okay. Save successful. This sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. It took a full 11 years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never before had solar energy been used to supply power to an entire city. But in 2004, Veltro, a terrorist group opposing the city's development, launched a bioterrorist attack. They not only released a virus, but also several creatures, known as bioorganic weapons, further complicating the situation. This launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC, the world's leading counter-bioterror organization operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter-bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests of any one country, went in as observers to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. Media outlets around the world began to refer to the incident as the Terra Grigia Panic. Following the incident, the FBC announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terra Grigia remains inaccessible a silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. But what about Umbrella Corps and... Um, and Raccoon City? Am I, am I just missing something? Is, is this different? Ah, there you two are. O'Brien, you don't normally join the Fey. Well, my doctor told me I need exercise. <laughs> I assume you both know that the FBC has cordoned off the entire area. However, in the past few weeks, a number of mysterious carcasses have washed up. I guess the FBC couldn't cover up a mess this big, huh? Anyone who knows what happened here is going to put two and two together. And that's why I've sent the BSAA in to investigate. Did you pick up your new equipment from Quint? Yeah. Uh, Genesis or something. Is that its name? You didn't bother to read the manual, did you? No, uh, I brought it with me, just in case. I hope you read quickly, because you're going to need it on your mission. <laughs> yeah, I'm on it. Great. All right. A ma manual. Am I gonna? I'm still gonna play a so, um, oh, Genesis manual. The nickname is a high level bioscanner currently being tested. It bounces special radiation of a target to analyze it. Um, it is possible to detect and analyze even the smallest amount of viruses. It has been possible to produce. Okay. Um, using synchrotron radiation, it is possible to detect specific objects. And if a detectable object is nearby, the indicator in the lower right area of the monitor will light up. Okay, I guess we have a little tutorial. Ah, look at this mess. Whoa, they're rotted to hell. Maybe you shouldn't be standing so close to it? Can I scan anything? More handgun ammo, nice. How do I activate it, though? <laughs> that's, that's what I want to know. Skin so pale. I've never seen anything like it. 
Use the Genesis to get a reading on it. Uh, that's this. Oh, old skin. That I'm one sexy mofo, right? Uh, of, of course. A decent sample size to get an accurate reading. Scan the carcasses on the beach and send me your data. All right, I can do that. No problem. I'm getting metal detected. From inside it. Yeah, metal. Careful now. Don't worry. I've done this before. Ew. I've got something. What is this? If it's an engineered mutation, this could prove a link. I'll run some tests on this. Continue with the investigation. He's very sketchy. He's definitely part of the, the, the bad guys. I can feel it already. I see you. You must be ammo. Yes, thank you. Nothing weird over here? Nope. Out there. That's where Terra Grigia was. Has it been a year already? Seems so. Already scanned that one, did I not? Yes, I already scanned it. Okay. More ammo over here. I do love my uh, me, myself some ammo. It would be very nice to get some. I had nothing in that one. Uh, are they supposed to be alive? The alive or? Okay, I think it's dead. After Raccoon City, this must be a oh, cakewalk. Raccoon City, huh? I suppose. So why'd you quit the FBC for this outfit? I wanted to be more involved. I wanted to fight. I see you two are okay. Continue with the investigation, but proceed with extreme caution. You mean like a flesh monster attacking us? Like uh, you could have warned us that flesh monsters. You were so calm. What, what is this thing? Are you another one that's alive? Hmm. We need more samples to run an analysis. Give me a few more. Eh, uh, nasty. That smell must have ruptured from gas. Christ, what a mess. How come it exploded when I got here? Main character syndrome, I think. All right, anything else over here? Oh, I can look here. FBC, looks like someone already raided the place. All right, that's, that's good to know. How far can I go here, though? A newspaper from last year. Here's the first article bringing the existence of BOWs to the public. I don't have enough data to run a complete analysis. Gather some more samples from the carcasses on the beach. I will, and I am. Gonna. I just need to uh, see what's over here, because there's some kind of path over here. Come on, they must have hidden something. No? Ah! Green herb. Uh, I still don't know, so I can see items I normally can't see, but I don't see anything flashing at the bottom right of my screen, though. Is it because my screen is too big? Oh, too much hang on, man. I got ammo, huh? Uh, alright. Let us... Oh, there's something over there I didn't take a look at. Can I sprint? Oh, well, maybe I can go out here. No, nothing here I can see, anyway.
Oh, maybe that is it. Okay, so if I'm near something... Oh. The thing at the bottom right here I can use, right? I don't pay you to play. Doesn't flash, pay though. You, to work. you pay me? I mean, yeah, of course you pay me. Yes, I, I work for you guys, of course. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find more flesh things, would you? I need one more somewhere. I'm pretty sure I scanned all of these, didn't I? Yeah, I think so. Also scanned you. I don't know if there's anything over here I missed. Oh, there's something up there I missed. You. Okay, I got it. Alright, buddy, I scanned everything. Uh, getting your analyze rate up to 100% will earn you a health recovery item. The rate you receive will go down if you analyze enemies of the same kind. I've collected enough samples. I shall do that, I suppose. I will. There you are. Nice work. No doubt about it. These corpses show signs of viral infection. And I bet it's no coincidence they came through the FPC's blockade. Well, we did all we can. Now, we wait for the results to come back from HQ. Huh? It's the emergency line. Yeah, it's me. Uh-huh. What? Yes, that's fine. I'll take it from here. We'll have to speed things up. Starting now. Uh-huh. Good. Get to it. Jill, Parker. You two are still on the case. What happened? We lost contact with Chris and Jessica. When? How? We're not certain. I've sent their last known coordinates to your terminals. The signal was lost over the ocean. I thought they were in the mountains chasing Feltro. But judging from their position, they must be... On a ship. I'll go back to HQ, take charge of the search and rescue. You two will be my eyes out there. Yes, sir. You can count us on us. Yeah. Wow, I didn't miss? I mean, yes, I'm used to not missing, of course. All right, let's go next then. That's cool. We should auto save, so I don't think I need to manually save. You think these things got to Chris and Jessica? I hope not. Hey, no one's saying Chris is dead. All right, then let's find him already. Oh, someone unlocked my door. Yes. You Can I loot it? Was that the lock? I'll check it out. Okay. I'll see what I can find here. Copy that. I'll raid oh, I didn't I keep my Chris's ammo. Trail. Item found. I'll take that. Okay, what about here? Another item found? What is that? More ammo for me? Oh, you didn't need to game. Thank you very much. This thing has a lot of similarities to the corpses on the beach. Christ, these things... No. It can't be. No, you have to you have to say it, dude. Is it like similar to something in Raccoon City or what? Okay, so let's see. There should be no more items in here because it doesn't flash anymore. Alright, let's go.
I thought for sure there's gonna be some kind of scare here, but no. Oh, come on, why would I What? Chris! Chris! Did that really be him? Come on, say something! I found Chris, but he's trapped in there. He's right in the next room. No, it's a tough lock. I need the key. Okay, then let's find it. Search for the key. Uh, going up is safer than going down, so I'll be going up. I see, we got a nice little herb up here. Oh, that's nice, I like that. I thought there would be something back here. There's an area that leads right and is closed off. It means that there's something there. And here apparently as well. Um, I don't like this area. <laughs> Do I have to be here? Can I crouch? I know you're back there. What? Oh, you're already dead? Okay, so it actually doesn't take a whole lot to kill you, does it? Oh, I'm happy I can find so much ammo everywhere. Okay, item found. Is there anything else around here? Oh, this hang on, hang on ammo. Okay, what about in here? Nothing. This place is a mess. Yeah, it, it is a mess. Uh, very, very much so. Can I open this up? Nope. What about this? No. All right, I'm on the other side. Now, I, I don't even know where I'm going, really. There's a cold trap coming from outside. Yeah, it's locked. There's an anchor mark on the door. Great. Yeah, I have to, I have to do puzzles now. That's also locked. Um, hello? Well, she's dead. Yeah, there's no there's no point in rushing in there. She's uh, <laughs> she's certainly not coming back alive. Yeah, right here. Okay. Green herb. I'll take that. I don't mind. The two of them. Find the butt. They can go this way, right? There should only be one left. Come on through the door. Or not. Like, I wish it was a bit more... Uh, it, it doesn't listen to me when I actually aim. Because there's a big dead zone issue, it seems. Okay, he's dead. I found a survivor. The BOW's got her, though. Who was she? I'm still trying to piece that together. 
Might be an important person for the case or something. Who knows? Nothing that could identify her. Let's see what the Genesis can tell me. Eh, uh, alright. Item found. Crew quarters area key. Parker, I couldn't find anything out on the woman, but I did find a key. Let's try it out. I'll meet you in the crisis room. See you there. Wait, I went the right way? <laughs> okay, well. Now I have to see what's downstairs before I go anywhere. Oh my god, okay. Who that scared me actually. I don't know why I got scared by that. It doesn't seem that weird. Still alive. Okay, now you're dead. You're so slimy. Oh, they can actually come from everywhere. If they're all in the vents, that's like so easy. Oh. I can go in here now. Thank you. Hand grenade. Thank you for the ammo. Do I have an inventory? I do. Genesis manual, ammunition, and green herb, and uh, hand grenade. Okay. I mean, so far so good, though. How did you even... How? Nothing else? Yeah, something over here. And there should be something else right here. And there should be something else as well. Wow. Now there should be nothing else. A bunch of handgun ammo. Ooh, and a hand grenade. You know what? I like that. I like that. This door is locked, yep. Still locked, eh? I, we shall take a look at that later. Oh boy. Maybe you could be nice and not do that ever again? Wow, now they're just coming out from everywhere. Whoops. Stop being so sporadic in your movement. It's very hard to hit you. When my, my cursor doesn't even respond to you. I, I'm gonna see if I can change the dead zone, because the dead zone is awful. <laughs> There we go. Even more nastiness all over the place. Okay, I'll be going down a bit here. Never mind. Okay, so this is why I have to go up, huh? Looks like a dead end. You can, you can jump, right? You're only gonna fall, like, very, very far down. It should be fine. Nothing nothing to worry about here, right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Jim. Okay. Come well, hello there. We gotta help Chris. Yeah, we gotta, go. we gotta help Chris. We gotta get him out of there. Chris! Chris? What is 
this? A trap? Oh, great. <laughs> oh, shit. It's a trap. <laughs> Where were you hiding this whole time? It's time you learned the truth, Miss Valentine. The end of episode one, okay. Time for episode two, I suppose. Yeah, accuracy could have been better, but it's fine. Next, let's see what happens next. On oh, no, Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed, what she said. <laughs> we lost contact with Chris and Jessica. The signal was lost over the ocean. Queen Zenobia. <laughs> Right here on this ship. No signs of life. But I feel like something's here. I think it's a gun. <laughs> this is not good. Hey, I didn't get hit by them. Chris! What is this? Oh, great. <laughs> it's a trap! <laughs> It's time you learned the truth, Miss Valentine. Double mystery. Now we're suddenly in the mountains of Europe. Slow down, Chris. We're almost there, Jessica. I certainly hope so. My feet are killing me. Our source indicates the camp is on the far side of this peak. Maybe it's the weather, okay. but I still can't make contact with HQ. Who'd have thought we'd be stuck out here for so long? Cool, so he has it too, huh? All right, well, that is also going to be it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed part one. Uh, let me know if you did in the comment section, if you want to, I suppose. Uh, I always am interested to hear you guys' opinions. Uh, but besides that, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, consider liking, subscribing, and of course, uh, sharing. Hope to see you in the next one, and as always, stay awesome. <laughs>